Hi, I'm Dr. Magdalene Kirshen from Victory Wellness and MedSpine. Today we will talk about pharmaceutical grade vitamin D3. And why is this vitamin so important? So vitamin D3 is not really a vitamin. That's a misnomer. It is a hormone, an active hormone. It's very, very important in our bodies. And actually, most people that have died from COVID in 2020 were found to have very low vitamin D levels. Uh, in their system, some studies show. So, so why is that so important? Why did uh, uh, the in, uh, increases the risk of death from COVID low vitamin D? Because vitamin D is extremely important regulating our immune system. So when it's at proper level, between 50 and 100, it has been found to stimulate immune system and increase our resistance to any infection, viral, bacteria. If it's low, it lowers our immune system and we become more likely to develop severe forms of all sorts of infections. So that's why it's so important. It's also very important in cancer prevention, Alzheimer prevention, heart disease prevention. It's basically a vitamin that's, in, and it comes from the sun. We mainly get it from the sun. It's converted into active form or called D3 vitamin in our skin. So what happens in most of us here in this temperate climates, uh, also wearing SPF to protect our skin and ourselves from skin cancer, we all are deficient in vitamin D3. And this is what I see. I routinely as a prevention, I test patients for D3 levels. And most of us, maybe 100% of us are below 50, but, but many of us are even below 30. So we actually walking around with severe deficiency, many of us, which if it's deficiency in children, what is it called? It's called rickets. There are people who have very weak bones and you see bow-legged kids you used to see in the olden days. And that was vitamin D deficiency in children. Now in adults, what happens if we're deficient? We get weak bones and it's called osteoporosis. So it's very important also to keep vitamin levels at a high level between 50 and 102 for osteoporosis prevention. So I recommend to my patients definitely vitamin D3 replacement of pharmaceutical grade, which is guaranteed absorptions and it guarantees you level between 50 and 100. And this is what I find in my patients when I retest. And I also recommend calcium. Uh, pharmaceutical cal calcium for people with, uh, especially women with osteoporosis, and calcium are about 500, 600 per day um, is an adequate dose for osteoporosis prevention. Um, and this is a pharmaceutical grade calcium and with pharmaceutical vitamin D3 guaranteed absorption.